What's up everybody? It's Eddie Cape here and I'm back in a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Destiny Year 2 and some awesome stuff that has just surfaced all over the internet and everybody's talking about it. So let's get right into it guys. If you guys don't know, the company Megabox has just released three random Destiny items. Now if you don't know, Megabox always makes Lego like Destiny things. It's something they've done for a long time. They make lots of cool sets and stuff like that. Anyway, um, apparently they up like they uploaded to Amazon three uh, normal everyday Destiny things, except for the last one, which was called a Cabal Bruiser Battle Building Set. And the description tells it all. Basically, it's summing up everything people want to know about Destiny Year Two, in my opinion. And here it is. Here's what it says: the Cabal Bruiser Battle Building Set. Buildable hangar platform sets the scene for a clash between a bruiser cruising strength and a master swordsman skill. The legendary warrior faces his greatest conte contest yet in the tower hangar. Wielding his razor light, hero of the crucible, Lord Shax prepares to pit his blade against the furious clever of a cabal red guard. So that is awesome. That actually falls along with the topic of everybody assuming that the tower is going to get overran by something in Destiny Year like year two or year, like I guess the next destiny, so destiny two. But um, everybody believes that the tower is gonna get exploded or taken over or destroyed or something along those lines. Excuse me. Um, and everybody thinks that's just gonna how, like that's how they're gonna tie in destiny two. So maybe this is a good thing, maybe it's a bad thing. I don't know. My opinion is that I hope they don't get rid of the tower. Personally, in my opinion, I love the tower. I remember playing in the tower in beta and I remember everybody being noobs just like me exploring see what we could find buying some gear and I remember waiting for the moon to be unlocked and stuff like that and it, it was only a few years ago too so I kind of hope they don't destroy it because that's some awesome memories but hey if that's what they have to do to make destiny 2 I'm happy with it anyway what does this mean the cabal red guard I'm not sure. No one knows what the Cabal Red Guard is. Until today when this was like announced, no one knew what the Cabal Red Guard was. In fact, no one heard about it. There is no place in the Destiny lore, as far as I know, where it says where it says Cabal Red Guard anywhere. That's using cleavers too. Like that's weird. I don't know any bosses that use cleavers. As far as I know. I don't know. Anyway, um, but it's weird. And I think that has lots to do with destiny 2 like they're trying to add new weapons add new characters like like enemies and stuff and maybe this is one of the new enemies cabal red guard who knows anyway that's all i'm going to talk about for that let's also get into the other part of this video which is my opinion on destiny 2 and uh basically my opinion on destiny 2 even though i just told you a little bit of it i'm gonna tell you even more basically one i don't want the tower to like get destroyed because one like I said that's all about memories in my opinion I remember playing destiny way back then and I played it and it was really fun and I was waiting for the moon to be unlocked and stuff like that it's really awesome but two I have some flaws not flaws but opinions I guess um, that I've been bouncing around my head that in my opinion I think sound good but to everybody else it probably sounds bad anyway that is I kind of want three more subclasses I don't know why but I just think it'd be an awesome thing like I don't know about you guys, but I'm getting tired of the old Hunter, Titan, Warlock. Instead, why can't it have, like, have t uh, Hunter, Titan, Warlock, maybe someone that levitates, maybe someone that, I don't know, controls bad guys. Maybe it's someone that can, I don't know, m like, shape shift. I don't know, something like that. Like, I want more versatility. I don't want to just be stuck to the same three characters for, what, three years, two years? What are we coming up on? Two years, I think? I don't want to be stuck with the same three characters in the next Destiny. I want more characters, guys. It's, it's, it's annoying. I'm sorry. If you are mad at me now, then I'm sorry. Anyway, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, if you guys want to check out any of this, I'll leave a link in the description to a Bungie forum where it tells you the exact thing. It even shows you links and it shows you pictures to the Amazon website. Uh, Amazon's website where you can find all that anyway guys I'm gonna leave the rift gameplay in the background for you guys to watch. It's an awesome comeback Literally, I did not think I was gonna win, but somehow we did that was awesome. It was clutch. Anyway guys. See you guys in the next video Peace out